special good morning to everybody. I uh, hope everyone's having a good start to your week. My name is Sandra DeSaro. I'm Cormark's Vice President of Sales Development, Analytics and Technology, and we're extremely excited to have you join our webinar today regarding Top Off Rewards, a proprietary loyalty program developed by Cormark and geared for retailers of any size out there. I'm going to take a quick step back and share with you why we're here. So several years ago, we began evaluating loyalty and loyalty platforms, and we observed a couple of things. Number one, we saw that uh, retailers who participate in loyalty programs outperform those that did not. Number two, we saw that from a consumer's perspective, they were expecting to be able to digitally engage and connect with retailers of all types. And further, they expected to have reciprocal benefit when they patronized a store. Three, we saw how costly and complicated it was to, to establish, to manage, and to create a, a loyalty program. And especially for smaller operators, this just wasn't even a possibility for many just due to the costs involved. As a result, we set off on a partnership and we found a company called PDI, who most of you know is a leader in software solutions, but they also were a leader in loyalty solutions. And through our partnership, we, we crafted a program that we feel is right for all retailers to participate in, particularly independents and smaller operators that allow you to have a custom loyalty program that's really allowing you to connect and engage with your consumers. We're gonna get into the details of exactly how this works. So with that, I will be turning it over to our program manager, Abigail Sarah, who oversees loyalty and software solutions at Cormark. Before I make that quick handoff though, I did wanna share that most of you saw that you are on mute as you entered this call, um, but please do, if you have questions, we wanna make sure that we answer those throughout or at least uh, address those at the, end of the, at the end of the webinar. So if you could, please utilize the chat feature within the webinar. Most of you can find it at the bottom of the screen and you can go ahead and enter your questions and both Abigail and myself would be happy to, to make sure we get through all those at the end of the call. If for any reason we don't, we'll make sure we connect with your sales representative so that you have access to that information. All right, with that, let me turn things over to Abigail. Take it away. Thank you, Sandra, and thank you everyone for uh, being here today. Over the past few months, we've introduced a suite of uh, so software solutions from our partnership with PDI. We've introduced an option for scan data to offer multi-pack discounts on your cigarettes uh, to your customers, and we've introduced a back office solution um, as well as a branded loyalty solution. And what we're um, here to discuss today is Top Off Rewards. It a, is a loyalty solution for retailers of any size. Um, like Sandra was mentioning, whenever we look at today's consumers and, and what their uh, what their expectations are, it's different than the consumers that that we've been used to. Um, you know, research from PDI, looking at those successful uh, retailers that that she mentioned, we see that about 63% of customers are belonging to C store loyalty programs already. So. You know, one, they are already, uh, they do already belong to these loyalty programs and they're looking for them when they're shopping. On top of that, these same consumers are willing to spend 51% more than expected to earn rewards, which means they will switch retailers for a rewards program that is meeting their expectations. Thinking of the different challenges and uh, why Top Off was created the solution uh, for this solution, we see that one of those biggest challenges is customer retention. One way that retailers are using loyalty um, or they're using loyalty to solve that solution. And we see that about 64% of retailers in the industry today are already on a loyalty program. But what that program typically is, is that major oil partnership out at the forecourt. It's you know, it's growing your fuel volume, it is bringing people uh, to your store, but it's not solving the, the purpose of growing your brand and, and engaging the customers with your brand specifically. Another, um, another challenge with loyalty is just that high cost, the, um, the resources that are required in order to, to access it and just the inability to access the funding from vendor partners that could be used to help offset some of those costs. And um, all of those challenges, that's what Top Off Rewards is solving. 
looking at some more of the statistics from these successful retailers that are on loyalty today, we see that when scan data is placed in, then loyalty is placed on top of that, um, and you're unlocking the maximum potential of discounts to offer to your customers, those sites have an, about 12 times more active members in their stores than uh, sites without tobacco loyalty offerings. For all loyalty in general, though, we're seeing an additional one to two visits per month by loyalty members. And so like when, you know, when we mentioned before the, that customers are willing to switch or willing to, or they're spending more for rewards, um, more than they're expected to spend, that's that one to two additional visits. We're driving incremental uh, trips and, and increased basket spend. All of that together, we're seeing um, about one to three thousand dollars in additional revenue per site per month. That's after all of your fees um, and you know and your investments are made. And and that's why we've created Top Off. Uh, this what we're going to talk about next is going to be all of the features and benefits of Top Off and how it works and everything that you're getting with this program. So what we've done. Um, is we've created an umbrella program, but it's unlike any other umbrella program out on the market today. Why is because we've leveraged a retailer scale to provide a, a mobile app and a loyalty uh, host that is available to a retailer of any size. Um, however, we've put a spin on it that your the rewards earned at your store can only be redeemed at your store or chain. So what I mean when I say that is if you have five stores, um, in your town and your customer is shopping at your store every day, they're earning rewards at your store, they can only come back to your store and redeem them at your stores. Um, even if there's a top off retailer across town and your customer happens to be on the other side of town and stop in there, that retailer does not benefit from the, um, the work that you've done building that relationship with your customers. They can't redeem the rewards there. What this does, it incentivizes your customers to continue shopping with you, specifically with you, and then built, continuing to build that relationship. Um, so while there are you know, multiple umbrella uh, programs out on the market, we, we believe that we've brought a solution that is, uh, that is unique and, and new. Some of the things that you're getting from Top Off Rewards, you're getting a fully built mobile app it's going to display all of offers and rewards that are specific to your site, as well as a map uh, that's going to help users locate your, uh, your sites easier. We have a offer network that has vendor funded offers um, where we've partnered with national brands to fully fund offers for your locations. And we're also um, unlocking tobacco uh, loyalty whenever you have scan data reporting available at your location. We've set up some pre-configured offers that will be funded by yourself that we believe are going to set you up for success. And then we also have some marketing, uh, a marketing team that's going to help you promote this. We're going to offer print material as well as digital marketing to engage your customers. So here's a quick uh, overview of the app. I'm gonna take us to the next screen and we're gonna, going to dive into the app a little further. So this app is available on both Apple and on Android. It is, um, it is currently um, in the final stages of production, so you will see it in both app stores shortly. When a user downloads the mobile app, they'll be greeted with um, our branding and logo on the launch screen, and then immediately taken to um, a screen that's going to serve two purposes. It's going to educate customers about how uh, what the program is and how to use it, and then it's going to allow them to either sign in or sign up for the program. So, uh, you know, by get, selecting getting started, a user can sign up, or by signing in, they can, um, as a return user, just enter their email and password. We're collecting the bare minimum that's required to be a true loyalty program, just your name, your phone number, zip code, email, and password takes about 30 seconds to sign up, really easy process. Uh, users can also reset their password from this screen, which is going to trigger a verification code that they'll enter as well. 
once uh, once a customer is inside the app, they'll be they'll see a map that has the closest location to them. Um, if they prefer a list view, here at the bottom of the screen, you'd be able to select a list view as well. That's going to show all of the stores, um, you know, in in order of how close they are to that store. You notice on this screen on the right, we see different cent per gallon amounts. That's what we were talking about earlier when I said that rewards can only be redeemed at the store or chain that they were earned at. So if you see this four cent gallon reward, imagine that's your site. Uh, both of these sites belong to you. They're part of your chain. Your customer can use that four cents per gallon at either of those stores. But if they shop with this next site um, on the list, there's no balance there. That site doesn't belong to you. They're not able to redeem their rewards at that location. By selecting a site, uh, and it'll pull up another screen that just goes into a little bit um, more detail. It's going to show uh, what kind of offers are available at your location, whether it's different product offers or club deals. It's going to track a basket spend, which is when you spend a certain amount of uh, money and you earn a reward for that. What we've done uh, is created an offer that is saved two cents per gallon for every $5 spent inside the store. We'll talk a little bit more about that later, but it's something you're going to see throughout the app multiple times, as well as in a lot of our marketing materials. So by, by clicking on deals, you'll see all of the all of the product offers. And then by switching to clubs, you'll see, um, you know, maybe it's buy five coffees, get one free. And it's going to track your progress towards that free product as well. By uh, selecting a club or any offer, whether it's a club offer or a deal, it's going to pull up more details about that offer to include any legal terms um, and conditions and just give uh, the customer a little better view. Customers can also use the app to view their account information as well as update information as needed. They can view the, um, they can view all of their transactions if they have a question about uh, when they earned a reward or maybe they think they're missing a reward. They can view their transactions to get clarity there. Um, a huge benefit to that mobile app is that we've taken the, the program as digital as possible. So um, by eliminating physical cards and having the option to scan this barcode you see on the screen, when a customer is shopping at your location, um, we're delivering on the expectation of the digital experience. Uh, for customers who maybe they don't want to download the app, their phone's dead or they left it at home, they can also use their phone number as an alternate ID and enter that in the pin pad or at the fuel pump to earn and redeem rewards as well. There's an option for beer and wine um, the age verification that users can opt into. We're going to use the information uh, that they gave us when they signed up, um, as well as a birthday that we're asking for whenever uh, whenever they opt into age verification. And we're going to run a, a check to actually verify their age um, and, and then they will be opted in to view age restricted offers. And then once again, we mentioned that um, you're going to see this, this offer multiple times in the app. We've got a full page dedicated that talks about this offer. That's really driving, um, this, this offer specifically is really meant to drive uh, transactions inside the store and give a benefit at the fuel pump as well. And then finally, we've got all of the, you know, legal requirements. We have how it works and we've got contact information. Um, and this contact information that's going to be displayed in the app, it will contact us here at Carmart. We'll handle the customer service for all calls related to top off rewards. If a call needs to, um, if a customer needs to reach out to you, we will um, we'll get them in contact with you, but we'll handle customer service here internally. Now that we've seen the mobile app, we're going to talk a little bit about the the offers that are going will be available in the app. So we've got two pieces of those offers. We have Abigail. If I could interrupt you real fast, we need to see your PowerPoint again.
Okay, so we've got uh, two pieces to that offer. We have vendor funded offers as well as uh, retail funder funded offers. And what we'll talk about first are those vendor funded offers. Uh, we've got two uh, networks that we'll be sourcing offers for you from. Um, these offers are sourced from national brands like you see on the screen. We're accessing shopper marketing funds that typically wouldn't be available to most retailers out there. They're, they're taken up really quick. Um, you know, that budget goes, goes fast. First, uh, we've got the Elevate Offer Network. That's a team at PDI who is, uh, their sole job is sourcing offers for these programs. Um, they are sourcing offers from uh, examples such as buy one Jack Links, uh, beef jerky bag, earn five cents per gallon, buy two Snickers, earn five cents per gallon, as those are some actual offers that have ran in the past. And these are brands that are uh, constantly investing heavily in loyalty. So we expect to see similar offers in the future as well. Um, on top of those offers, we here at Cormark will be sourcing from the suppliers that we have relationships with. Both of the, the both uh, sets of offers, these will be available on a quarterly basis. You'll be able to log into a portal and select which offers you want to run at your stores. You can manage these down to site locations. So, you know, if you have five stores and one store is not carrying Jack links, you can run the offer at four of those five sites. Um, and then in addition to the access to the offers, we are going to send you promotional signage to promote these offers uh, to your customers. So when you select your offers, you'll also select the signage that goes along with those offers and it'll ship directly to your site for you to place um, when the promotions begin. The second set of offers will be retailer funded offers. These are pre-configured for you and are designed to drive uh, incremental trips and to drive that basket spend uh, with, with top off uh, customers. So this first set on the screen, the ones that say uh, retailer funded offers, these are all required uh, to participate in in order to be a top off retailer. We have a registration reward, which is an incentive to your customers to sign up for the program where they'll save five cents per gallon on their next fill up. And when we say fill up, we've limited the purchase to 20 gallons. When we also have two base offers, one for the fuel and one for in-store. Every day, active top-off customers will save three cents per gallon on their fill up. And they will save two cents per gallon for every $5 they spend in-store. That $5 spend has some restrictions on it, such as uh, beer, liquor, wine, cigarettes, tobacco, and other age-restricted, um, you know, lottery, money orders, any kind of service categories. And that's something that once you're ready to sign on, we could talk about in further detail as it does vary by state um, in some instances. All of these offers though are stackable to where a customer can earn, for example, the first time they sign up, they're saving that five cents, they have their base three cents saving, and maybe they spent $10 on eligible products in your store. They now have 12 cents per gallon for the next time that they, uh, per they purchase fuel at your location. Um, and once again, that's limited to 20 gallon purchase. We just talked about the vendor funded offers that are part of the program. You are required to participate in vendor funded offers, um, and, but once again, you can pick and choose which ones of those that you're participating in. And then finally, we have club offers. These um, are pre-configured by us for you to choose from. We'll have um, a wide variety of different club offers to make sure that you are investing at a level that you're comfortable with. So the example you see here on the screen, buy five coffees, get one free. We may have, um, you know, buy five coffees, get one free, buy seven, buy 10. Um, and that way you're choosing the level you're investing in uh, that's best for your brand. Once again, you are required to participate in club offers be, um, as long as you're participating in a minimum of one, but can participate in as many as you choose. And then, of course, we have the tobacco loyalty. So if you're participating in scan data, whether um, you have um, a partnership already or you are interested in our PDI solution, uh, you unlock the multi-pack discounts, which is funding from the manufacturers to pass along to your customers. Um, and a sample or an example of that would be, say, 50 cents on any two packs of Marlboro. 
by uh, implementing top offer awards, you're unlocking that third tier of multi or of the contract, which is the loyalty funding, which could give an extra dollar. So now instead of say 50 cents when you buy two packs of marble, you're now saving $1.50 when you buy two packs of marble just for collecting your customer's phone number or their, um, their, their card information, that unique ID that's in their app every time that they shop. Um, the cigarette manufacturers are going to incentivize you for that. No additional um, configuration is required from a scan data perspective. In order to make this happen, you would just need to reach out to your cigarette manufacturers to let them know you now have a loyalty program and you're ready to participate in that next level of the contract. So we mentioned a portal where, you'll, where you will select offers and select your signage. Here's a quick screenshot, um, a snapshot of that portal. You'll have access to this portal uh, with credentials that are specific to you, as well as anyone else that you on your team that needs access to it. This portal has uh, a few different um, purposes. It's going to let you select your offers on a quarterly basis, um, both vendor funded and those pre-configured offers we mentioned. Once you select offers, you'll be guided to select which signage you want for those offers. So um, like the signage you see here on the screen is the actual example of signage that you would be receiving. For, um, you know, if it's a Pepsi offer, you would have an option to choose either a clean for your cooler door, or maybe it's a, a, a shipper sign to go on a shipper that you've got sitting in your store. You can choose what you need. And then finally, you can use this portal for reporting to see how your program is performing overall, how specific sites are performing, even how specific offers are performing. And then finally, you can use it to uh, reconcile the settlement. For um, all of these offers that we've mentioned, they are fully funded um, for the vendor offers, are fully funded by the vendors and will be reimbursed to you um, at the end of the program. So uh, within 45 days of the quarter ending. This is a, a snapshot of what the promotional um, and launch signage would look like. This launch signage here on the screen, a window sign is something that you can uh, will be sent to you when you sign on to the program. It will be used to generate excitement um, and, and drive app downloads and, and membership for the program. It's something you can keep up continuously throughout the program as well. On top of the launch kit, you're going to receive quarterly signage that will be uh, offer specific, something that you'll put up for when the promotions start and take that when they end. The, all of that will be shipped directly to your sites. On top of the print marketing, we'll have digital marketing. Um, our team will be responsible for sending out uh, emails and push notifications to engage your customers with top offer awards. We have a welcome email that is sent out um, when a member first signs up for the program that's going to do a little bit of education and just help drive them back to, to start using that program. Um, there'll also be ongoing um, educational emails sent out. Maybe um, if there's a new feature that's added onto the app we want people to be excited about, we'll send an email and push notification out for that as well. So, now that uh, we've mentioned all of the features and that you're receiving with top offer awards, everything that's included in the mobile app, the offer network, uh, and, and all of the, the marketing as well, we'll talk about uh, what to do when you're ready to, to sign the contract. So the first step is to get with your Cormark representative and sign a contract. Um, we'll talk about what that contract and the terms look like in the next slides. Uh, the next step is to connect your POS with PDI's loyalty host. Uh, this, depending on how your hardware is currently set up today, what uh, what systems that you're running, this step could be the longest step in the process. It could create a little bit of friction, um, but PDI has a team dedicated to establishing this connection with you. And once we get through this step here, um, everything else is smooth sailing. Um, after your, the connection is established, PDI has some work that they need to do on the back end to configure everything. And while they're doing that, you'll opt into the offers that you'll be participating in, um, as well as choosing your signage, which will then be shipped to you. You'll be able to start training your teams, uh, getting them excited about the program 
getting that signage up in the store and then launching the app finally. So we've got the um, everything with Top Off Rewards. We have the Mobility app. We have a team of uh, consumer engagement specialists to handle all the digital marketing. We have the offer network with fully funded uh, offers from national uh, supplier partners, as well as we've created site funded offers to set you up for success and allowed you to unlock the tobacco loyalty offers. All of this will be settled uh, for you. You'll receive your reimbursements from Cormark um, at the end of all the at the end of each program. And you're also receiving a uh, launch signage and ongoing promotional signage the, for a cost of $99 per month per site uh, with a startup fee of $250. That startup fee is covering your launch signage um, as well as your ongoing promotional uh, signage material. If you are not currently participating um, in scan data with us, or if you're interested in um, learning about our back office solutions for a price book, we are offering our C Store Essentials program at a discounted rate of $40 per month. Um, without top off rewards, that is $59 per month per site. Um, if you are already participating in that program through us, you would receive a new um, discounted rate by signing up for top off rewards. So we talked about the term um, about the fees. It is a one year term. Uh, there are some additional fees um, that we would have to look at during the setup, and that's going to depend heavily on on your location. So we've got the um, a few different options, and we would talk with you when the time comes about which one's best for you. Another consideration on um, financial commitments is those retailer funded offers, you know, the acquisition offer, the base offers, the club offers. Um, those are funded by, by you and are something you sh should consider when you're looking at, um, at, the, at the financial commitment. The, the only hardware requirements um, to be compatible with top off rewards is your POS system. This is, um, there is no restrictions to which back office system that you're running, but you must have a Gilbarco passport, a Verifone commander or Ruby system, uh, or NCR radiant, um, and then finally a Wayne. So um, as long as you're running with one of those POS devices, you are, um, el you're eligible for top off rewards. So uh, now that we've talked about um, all the benefits, how to get you signed up and um, you know what that financial commitment looks like, what questions can we answer for you today? And I don't see any on my side, Abigail. I don't know if you have questions on your side. It looks like I've got a couple come in. So if a customer is already a member of an existing C store loyalty program, is there a way to link top off rewards with that existing program? So um, it's going to be really common that we see uh, top off rewards and a major fuel um, rewards program at a site at the same time. Let's use Shell Fuel Rewards um, as an example. You can, um, or you know, or even Exxon Mobil Rewards is another good example. If you're running that um, at your site and you want to implement top off loyalty, when a customer, uh, let's say they pull up to your fuel pump, they'll see a screen that's listing all of the available loyalty programs that you have at your location. The customer would select which loyalty program they want to participate in at the time of purchase. And then that information would be communicated to PDI's host and PDI would send back the rewards that are applicable to that program specifically. Um, so while the programs cannot be linked together, they can uh, live together at the same time at the site. Customers would just have to choose which one they're participating in. And this is a really common setup uh, that we're seeing um, with retailers across the country today. Um, after the initial setup, is there a cost to additional signage that is ordered when offers change? No, that $250 setup fee is going to cover the cost of your launch signage and your ongoing promotional signage for the term of, uh, for the entire time you're a top off retailer. Um, we have a question asking, will you let us know when the site, uh, when the app is available in the app store? So as soon as the app is available, we'll, we'll um, communicate that out to, to everybody and make sure it's well known so you can download that and get a, a firsthand feel of how the app will function. 
And right now we're expecting that to be about the second week of June. Is there a small brochure that customers can hand out to, or that cashiers could hand out to customers for signing up with top off rewards? Um, so that's not something that we have developed today, but it's you know ongoing support um, to make sure that you're set up for success is that's what we're here for. It's it's why we're doing this. So it's something that we'll definitely look at. I don't have any additional questions coming in, but um, I think we have a, maybe we'll give it a couple minutes to see if anyone else has any last minute questions. If a question comes up, once again, just uh, you can reach out to your Cormark representative um, and you'll be able to, and we'll get back to you on those questions. Right, and we'll see if we have any more, um, but uh, I, I do want to say thank you, Abigail, for presenting the program and for our retail partners. We appreciate your time and, and joining our webinar today. I, I think this is very exciting. Um, we really have seen great benefit in, in the value that loyalty platforms do provide. Uh, so, you know, welcome you joining and being a partner with us on this. So, uh, Abigail, any final questions that you see coming in? I don't have any more on my screen now. All right, well, we'll let you have the rest of your day back. We appreciate again your time and thank you for joining us today. Have a great rest of the day. Bye. Thank you.